Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. I start with the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. I praise Allah and I ask Allah humbly to raise the rank of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, his kind ahl, his companions and all those who follow him and to protect the nation of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam from that which he feared for it. My name is Imad Isaacs and it is indeed an honor and a privilege to address you from the holy lands of Mecca al-Mukarramah, the home to al-Masjid al-Haram, the sacred mosque and al-Ka'bah al-Mubarakah. I want to also take this opportunity to invite you to part two of the BTG Personal Obligatory Knowledge Seminar Series. Last year during November 2011, we managed to cover part one. Now the personal obligatory knowledge of Islam comprises many, many matters. Matters of the belief, matters of tahara and salat, purification and prayer, matters of zakat, of fasting, of hajj, of the sins of the body, and also some of the matters of dealings. In 2011, in November, we managed to cover Kitab al-Aqidah wa ridda which means the chapter of belief and apostasy. What makes a person Muslim and what takes him out of the fold of al-Islam. Knowing what befits the Creator and what does not befit the Creator, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Knowing what attributes are suitable for the messengers of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and what are not befitting to His messengers, alayhim uh, salawatu wa salam and also how to guard oneself from disbelief, from falling into the category of apostasy. So inshallah in part two we will be looking at tahara and as salat. Now this follows on from the hadith of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam in which he said, the hadith related by Imam al-Bukhari, أَفْضَلُ الْأَعْمَالِ إِيمَانٍ بِاللَّهِ وَرَسُولِ The most precedented of deeds is the belief in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and his messenger. Following that Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, to pray the prayer in its prescribed or its proper time. So inshallah, join us for this chapter of purification and prayer in the matters of purification. We'll be dealing with many things in the matters of uh, salat. We'll also be dealing with a number of things from the conditions to the integrals to the conditions to the, of rewardability of the salah to salat al jumuah salat al janazah salat al jamaah as well as the conditions for the khutbah in salat al jumuah and uh, a number of other things inshallah and uh, I ask you to not forget me in your du'as inshallah and, and most importantly don't forget this date the 13th, the 14th and 15th of April 13th and 14th will be the workshop followed by uh, a, a hike at the Silver Mines Nature Reserve on the 15th of April followed by amazing breakfast inshallah transport is included so visit the website, like the BTG page spread the message on Facebook, let your friends know send everybody an SMS Insha'Allah, barakallahu bikum, and don't forget me in your du'as. Make du'a to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that uh, He grant me umrah maqbula, insha'Allah, and that I also have a safe trip home, uh, that I arrive promptly, insha'Allah, on the 12th of April, so that I may also be there for the seminar happening on the 13th of April. Barakallahu bikum, shukran, wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.